everyone, this is Anubhuti from sensitive.com. Welcome back to my channel and today I'm going to show you how I do my eyebrows. Yes, I do my own eyebrows at home and I'm going to share how I do it. I went to Miniso and I spotted eyebrow razors. Uh, I have known about eyebrow razors for quite a long time but I was skeptical, uh, skeptical to give it a try. Um, but uh, I spotted a pack of three at Miniso like this kind of eyebrow razors I'm talking about I spotted the pack of three for 15 HKD and I thought yeah why not give it a try and if I don't like it I can throw it away yeah so um, this is how the razor looks like it is like a spoon kind of thing with the protective cap on and then there is a razor part you can see this is quite sharp uh, so let's uh, get on with the process what I do follow these days uh, like how I do step by step if you are a beginner you have to follow these steps for some time and uh, then once you get used to it you can do it so yes without any further ado let's start so first thing I, I'll let you know what all things you need so uh, first thing is of course your uh, eyebrow razor then you need a pair of tweezers and then you need one Kajal pencil or your eyebrow pencil, anything. Then you need your eyebrow brush or I use uh, the mascara wand. So, and yes, of course, one short mirror, a little bit of uh, what you can say magnifying kind of mirror or normal mirror will do. So, yes, this and one wet wipes. To wipe off your face and any kind of face mist or rose water which you use to calm down the skin post usage so let's start and so first thing I like to do is uh, draw the guideline if you're a beginner it is necessary to uh, draw a guideline what it does it helps you to uh, keep the shape you want for your eyebrows uh, also it will make sure that you do not over tweeze or uh, over overly shape your eyebrows and one more thing about your eyebrow shape is it is best to follow your natural eyebrow shape that suits you best so first thing we are going to just comb out all your uh, hair uh, eyebrow hair in a now we are going to draw a guideline and for that we will start with the kajal pencil so the ideally what I do is just the thin take the, measure the thin part of your nose and just go like this and yeah there is a mark apparently it's correct for me and then this side so yeah this is correct before you do this make sure your face is clean and moisturized there is no makeup uh, no powder or anything like that on your face uh, so yeah I've done the same I have just moisturized my face and there is no makeup or no excessive product on just my serum and uh, my day cream on my face so we'll do it um, like this and then uh, as you can see my arch is right here and if you have lot of uh, like um, hair that's and you want to redefine your uh, shape so what you will do you will look in the front and then you'll start from the thin part thin part of the nose the top from the center of your eyebrows yeah it is looking horrible so yeah it is here and then your end uh, for end part ideally it should be like uh, the edge of your nose edge of your eyes and then your eyebrows it should be here and then same here yes now what you're going to do is you're going to just join it like you fill your eyebrows and yes you're going to do that you draw both eyebrows like equally so it's look it looks quite animated right now so now I will first take the razor like this and you are going to just uh, everything above the 
line out of the guideline you draw just shape everything just going to use the razor as is clean the upper side now the time now we are going to just clean the lower side make sure that you do not go very near to your eye line uh, like Okay, so this side we have ended up tweezing, uh, sorry, uh, using razor and now time for tweezing. So what I'm going to do uh, that you can see there are one or two hair which got left because I did not want to go very near to my eyebrow shape. So uh, yes, so we are going to just tweeze these extra parts. Make you have tweezed uh, that area now you can just pick up your razor and clean that up again like this you can see there are very tiny tiny things left here so you just can clean that up Okay, just leave everything even if you feel like there is one extra hair or something like that and if it, it falls under that guideline, leave it. Trust me, leave it otherwise you'll end up over tweezing it. This side is done and you can see now uh, what any one thing is left. Just pick up your spoolie brush, brush everything up. like this take a pair of scissors the small ones and whatever is above the guideline just cut it be careful do not over cut it just cut it till your guideline is there allows you now just bit and the side is done i'll be doing the next the same thing on the other side and then we'll see the finishing result now my both eyebrows are done i'm just gonna take a wet tissue and just clean up the mess I'm going to wipe the tweezers as well it is very very important that you keep them clean so uh, now last step uh, is uh, I'm going to uh, take the, this Avian uh, thermal spray water you can take any uh, calming toner or calming rose water you like uh, I prefer this one because this is perfect for my sensitive skin so I just like to do is uh, close my eyes and spray it So, and now I'm just spreading it in. Leave it, I'm going to leave it like that and it will dry up. This is how I do my eyebrows at home. Uh, if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Or also, if you want to uh, see more such videos, please let me know in the comment section below. Uh, I would love to do it. Uh, that's all. If, you want, if you're interested in product reviews, fashion tips, anything, head over to my blog, sunsteve.com. And yes, do not forget to subscribe to my channel and click that bell button so that you'll get notification whenever I upload a video. That's all. Bye-bye, guys.